Okay guys, so we're back here. Day three. Day three, Disneyland video. Now Tracy. day three, you're not gonna really see too much. It's basically just us talking about what we did that day because that was our rest day. Yep. Mm -hmm. We rested. Yeah, well we did some other stuff that day. I don't really, I think we kind of went back to the parks just to kind of mess around. Yeah. I don't really remember what all we did that day. I just remember not filming a lot because that was my rest day. Yeah. Whatever. Anyway, so uh, I'm basically going to take you through my part, first part of the day, because Nathan and I split up during the first part of the day, and then we um, I met up to do some other stuff mm -hmm. uh, the next, and we'll talk about that. So my first part of the day was my spa, my spa day. Uh, the spa was very good. It was the, uh, Man the Mandara Spa, and um, I did a review on that, actually, uh, the Mandara Spa uh, in uh, Disney's... Um, California uh, was the Grand Californian uh, Hotel, which is great because it was literally a five-minute walk from my hotel. Uh, which you know the other ones are. I mean the hotels are all like you know a five-minute walk from mm -hmm. each from, from each other. It's really great. So I walked over there. Uh, it was great. It was really early in the morning. I think it was the first one that day, and um, it was just it was fantastic. It was just a great experience. Everybody was really nice. Um, I went in, you know, checked in. They gave me the flip flops and the the uh, the spa what is robe. it the robe and it was great I had to you know they gave me a, a special lock and everything uh, the locker mm. rooms were really nice really clean everything was just really relaxing and then they said okay come in here and you can drink you know like lime water or, you know the this special tea you know like green tea infused something chai berry whatever chai berry chai berry I don't know what that chai means berry. I don't know what that means I just I didn't touch any so I just sat with my hands just like this. Because I didn't want to break yeah, nothing. Yeah, that sounds like you. Yeah, I didn't want to hurt nothing, yeah. break nothing. I took a couple photos. Um, and then a tiny little, very nice Asian lady came in and uh, gave me a, uh, I think it was a nice big, it was great. It was a, a tri-enzyme uh, papyrus platypus, whatever it was, facial. Yeah, yeah, pair of the platypus. No, it was like a papyrus tri-enzyme uh, facial, whatever. It was great. I try, highly recommend it. Uh, I got a, um, a manicure and a pedicure because I'm manly like that. Yep. Yeah, and um, got man in the name. Yeah. No, it was great. I mean, it was just it was like oh, and, and a hot stone massage. Now, if you've ever had a hot stone massage, those stones are not lukewarm. It's not a lukewarm they, stone massage. I it mean, is a hot stone massage, and they, uh, they say it was words. a little scorching. And she was barehanding them, and I'm like, hun. How are you doing that? <laughs> Black magic, probably. Yeah, I, I I don't think she has feelings in her hands I think anymore. She is a uh, sorcerer. I was causing her pain, and I felt bad. I was like, she honestly, is, uh... you, you can just rub my legs. You don't even have to do none of that. So anyway, yeah, that was my spa experience. I would totally recommend it. Five out of five. Uh, the spa isn't the biggest spa in there. You know, it's not the biggest Mandara spa out there, uh, but it is very luxurious and uh, one of the best spas that I've ever been to. So check that out, the Mandara spa. While all that was happening, Nate ate a sandwich. Well, I just ate did sandwich. you sleep in at all? Actually, not really that much. I mean, I woke. I'm, I I must have got out of there around seven thirty. So I maybe woke woke up at like eight. Uh, okay, just gonna go back to sleep. Yeah, I mean, I was I'm in Disney. I'm, I'm used to getting up early, so I was ready to go. So I, what'd you I do? just kind of chilled around, watched some TV for a while, explored the hotel a bit. What'd you think of the hotel? Oh, it's awesome. I like I love exploring hotels. I'm weird like that. I like exploring mm. hotels. Just, you know, seeing, going through the random shops and the little restaurants on the thing. Uh, probably got some, I got breakfast, I got a bagel. Bagel? I got a bagel at the uh, little coffee shop. Uh, you got a bagel at the Kotel coffee shop? Yes. Okay. Um, and then... Yeah, that's where you found Mom's cup. Yeah, I found Mom it wanted we a special it. mug yeah, she wanted, like, that she wanted for... It was, yeah, she likes back. these special mugs they have everywhere. Um... That's where I found it. Didn't get it until the last day, but I knew they had them there. Uh, then I went to the Earl's Sandwich and ate a sandwich, and it was a... So you're telling me the sandwich place got us, gave you a sandwich that was only eh? Um, like, if you could rate it, what would you rate it out of... Rate the Earl of Sandwich experience. The whole experience or just the sandwich? Cause the whole experience, the experience. Okay, uh, whole experience, I'd say like a... 3.3? Th okay. How Sorry. was the actual sandwich itself? Like a, two, maybe like a two point one. Okay, what sandwich did you get? I got the just the original roast beef sandwich with cheese and horseradish. It should be good. It sounds good. It's they they it was too horseradishy for me. That's just uh, personal okay, opinion. Okay. If you like that, 
Um, I do like horseradish, but it was just a bit bit much. All right. Um, they what else? I had some soup, chicken noodle soup, with soda on the side. All right. Um, Luckily, well, you didn't eat too much because we, we were going somewhere that day. I'll tell you, we, we were, were going to go somewhere. But uh, yeah, I ate that, and the soup was good. You know, it wasn't a bad sandwich. I ate it. I was full. Mm -hmm. I didn't leave feeling dissatisfied. Mm -hmm. It was just kind of like I wanted some more. You know, because oh. we had seen Earl of Sandwich since we went to Disney World. They have one down there. Oh. And I kind of wanted to go, and we never went for years, and I had the chance to go, and I was there. And then I just kind of walked around that area, downtown Disney mm -hmm. area. Did, didn't do much. Chill. Well, somehow we managed to meet up uh, at mm -hmm. the uh, at the room at, our, I think it was around 12, like when I got back, because my, yeah. my situation took that. forever. Uh, but it was nice. Mm -hmm. He had apparently a good time, and uh, that was our off day. And we, it was the day since we were in California, we wanted to actually go to someplace nice. Let's see California, or at least the most. And uh, the main thing was we wanted to touch the Pacific Ocean. We did. That's probably the only time I'm ever going to touch the Pacific Ocean. So I was able to say I touched it. I put my hands in it, put my feet in it. And I'm saw done. An oil rig. Yeah, they got, what what is up with that guy? You guys got like oil rigs and crap in your ocean. It was like right, it was like yeah. right there. And you guys got like great white sharks and surfer dudes. Those surfer dudes are cool though. Yeah, they were pretty chill. That was like that I was, was so happy to see that. Yeah. Like that's like me going to New York and getting the smelly subway car. I love that. That's a New York experience. So mm -hmm. when you go to California, you want to see an old dirty hippie strumming a guitar. You know, he probably slept there, woke up and just started strumming. Yeah. You know, I want to see that. That's good stuff. And uh, so, yeah, we went to uh, we, we went to the ocean. We went to Huntington Beach, mm -hmm. and uh, we got a cab there. And they Disneyland for, uh, has cabs that just kind of sit right out there. It was like fifty bucks. Yeah, it's which like, was a little bit outrageous for me. But it was also cheaper than it would have been if we had just taken the cab. No, that was the actual cab. But I looked at the fare, and the fare was like fifty six. And then he just gave it to us for fifty okay. because we went from the. Uh, but I'll tell you what was cheaper. Yep. Going home, we wound up using Uber. Uber! <laughs> so that was our little tip for you. The first time we ever used Uber was in California to get us back yep. to the Disneyland Hotel. Just so you know, Uber drivers really like talking about how good Uber is. Yeah, so good stuff. I like Uber. I, I think it's great. It's good. It's okay, so we went to the ocean. That was nice. Huntington Beach. Walked around a little mm -hmm. bit. So the, the, the other thing we wanted to go to was Slater's 50-50. Mm-hmm. Which is, I don't know if you guys know this, especially, you know, people that are, are from California. It's a, uh, it's a burger joint, which has like a 50-50 half beef, half bacon burger. Yep, half That's what they're bacon. known for. Um, it was pretty good. I enjoyed it. I really liked it. Um, Nathan didn't quite like the yeah, burger. I, I it liked just, it. Uh, I liked it. I enjoyed it. It's just, it was too much bacon for yeah, me. Yeah, it was too much. I, I think texture wise, I just would have preferred just regular ground beef. Which you which you can get. You can get regular. They have a lot of they have a lot ton of beer on tap. That yeah, was like tons of, of beer. Tons of beer tons on tap. Of beer. Great, you know, atmosphere. The, the 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 manager gave us like a free dessert. Yeah, it was which like, was you fantastic. Can use this now or later, we were like, well, we're never coming back, so let's use this now. And it was <laughs> awesome. I mean, the service there was excellent. It was great. Um, it was great. You know, the food was really good. You know, they have everything that you could possibly want. Mm -hmm. Bay with bacon on it. Bacon, bacon, bacon is everything there. That's why I wanted to go. And uh, it was great. You know, the experience was good. Five big stars for Slater's 50-50, but that will never be reviewed on my show. But I just figured I'll, it's I'll mention it right now. Slater's 50-50 was very good. I enjoyed that. Um, so we took the Uber back to the hotel, and then I think we just decided just to go to the parks. Just go around. See we just, you know, we, we were walking around and um, got some stuff. We went into the... Oh, Nathan, the biggest thing here for that day was Nathan got his first Dole Whip. Dole Whip? And uh, he loves pineapple stuff, and I, I love pineapple stuff. I've been building this up for him, and I knew he was gonna like this. I uh, and show enough, he I, loved the Dole Whip. I would recommend the Dole Whip Float, the classic. It's classic. Like you can have regular Dole Whip, which is just you know the pineapple soft serve type stuff. They also sell just pineapple juice by itself. Why not put them together? And you got it's a magical experience in your mouth. It's like little fairies, little pineapple fairies, just lighting off little explosions from their wands in your mouth. It's great. It's well, a, that's a, that it's was a delight to the senses. That was a great word picture, Nate. Yeah, <laughs> that was a delightful word picture. Yep. You are a Bob Ross of the English language. Well, yeah. 
Okay, okay. Uh, but yeah, so that was the first time he got Dole Whip, and uh, it was it was great. Just uh, it was a great day, and uh, I was I very spent happy. Like Forty five dollars on Dole Whip alone. Oh no, yeah, he totally did. <laughs> Like, I was kind of done, finished eating mine, and I was like, you know, I can't eat the rest of this. Well, I take it. it. <laughs> and he just kind of inhaled it, so why not, right? It was good. Yeah, so uh, day three was our rest day. That's pretty much what we did. Uh, it wasn't anything too fancy. I didn't take any video. It was all pictures because, well, I didn't want to do anything. Uh, that was our rest day. So, yeah. So that was day three, our rest day. And um, stay tuned for part four coming whenever. Uh, and it uh, should be fun for all of you, hopefully. Well, it's fun, it's fun for us to reminisce, so it's great. Uh, do, uh, but this is the end of day three. Awesome stuff. Thanks for watching. That is hoppy.